I received that one. OK, even I did not check this today. OK, let's see that one with the warning message. So the the configuration the, as I told there is a, some configuration. If we are not doing properly that configuration, then. So first let me let me take any one of the existing BP. 252 let me take this BP then which group I have assigned. Let me check here. You came triple zero. Credit profile credit segment. OK, so medium risk which I have assigned. OK, so the credit limit which I have given this much credit limit. But let's see what I will do. I will just change this. The I will just change the credit limit. OK, 25 lakhs has been given, right? OK, already crossed, already utilized. OK, I think this will not work. OK, I'll create quickly one new business partner. <coughs> credit OK. In the language is English. Just check this one. If there are any error system up front, it will show here. Because error free. OK, let me save this one. Okay, the business partner 53 has been created. OK, fine. So let me assign the. Change, <clears throat> let me assign the. New role first, let me create the FI customer. Then afterwards I will create the sales organization. OK, switch the company code and give the company code. Enter. Reconciliation account. This was the one what we have created. Come to the payment terms of payment. And if you want sort key, you can just give the sort key, which is missed here. Customer. Okay, save this one also. Then <clears throat> just note down the customer number. This is the customer number. 30,014 has been created. Okay, now what I will do, let me assign the credit. Okay, assign the role you okay, okay, customer first role is the SD sales and distribution since we are going to sales and distribution assign the sales organization. Enter. Sales district customer group. Send all not required. Come to the. OK, pricing procedure. It is it is it has been assigned. It's a mandatory to assign. If you are not assigning, the system will not determine the pricing. OK, then come to the shipping. Delivery priority normal only delivery plant must have to give shipping conditions manual only normal conditions. Then. Tolerance tolerance and this will not applicable. Come to the billing tab. My state in version not required in core terms so just to give the location. <clears throat> then terms of payment specify that terms of payment. Then let me save this one. Then assign one more credit UKM triple zero. <clears throat> Come to the credit profile. It is there in general data only select the all external customers just then let me select the medium risk. Check rules default all checks. This is just for reporting purpose only domestic customers or international customers. Come to the credit segment. Select the segment which is applicable. Maintain the limit. Let me maintain here is the limit is the only 10,000. Then approve the limit. OK, release the limit. Then, then save it. Fine. 
area general data correction error what is that error times it will get that error let me try to save this one ah, see no change yes okay without changes system has been accepted sometimes it will get that error okay changes have been saved okay let us create the let me check here what has been configured for the credit management integration with the accounts receivable accounts payable <clears throat> integration with then come to the default automatic credit controls this is the one important thing medium risk right what i will do medium medium risk okay okay so the medium risk what what i have mapped here to the medium risk let me check this item also item category check so the reaction reaction which i have mapped it's a should throw the warning message it should not okay so like it's a a, a in the sense it's a warning message only okay let me check that item <coughs> sales order a01 order type is or <coughs> customer sold sold to party and this one f by customer company code data what is the number this is the number okay, <clears throat> okay 28 01 2023 okay let me view that item so the credit limit what we have offered to the customer the credit limit we have offered credit management go to the credit is a 10,000 we have given okay now we'll try to key the 20 quant 25 quantity okay whatever 50 quantity now you can see here okay now 50 quantity in the sense because in the condition in the week 11 condition what i have mapped per quantity the system need to consider is a 50 500 rupees okay per quantity okay 50 into 50 into 500 rupees it is equal to 25000 rupees now what system is trying to do the credit limit which we have given okay the credit limit we have given only the 10000 rupees in the business partner now you can see here this was the credit limit what we have offered to this customer even though even though the customer is trying to okay utilizing the customer is trying to create the sales order with more amount okay with more than the credit limit what they are having now system is trying to system is telling that the 15,000 rupees the exceeding the limit okay total 25,000 rupees this is what what we have expected okay check credit limit credit management failed see now yesterday's message is differ okay yesterday's message differ in the sense credit management unable to save okay if i do not want to allow to this customer okay what i will do let me let me do that okay let it be keep i mean i want to keep the same let me show you that one the error message difference between error message and warning message okay let me come back here let me try to one okay for one also i just made its error message only okay then what i will what i am trying to do just i just made it as a error message okay so now how error message looks like sir? va01 okay we need to know that one the 51 business partner 
right this one 3 12 then let's see let us see that one Two hundred quantity. <clears throat> Let's see what system. What is the reaction? Now you can see the difference between. Understand here, the difference between check credit, SAP credit management failed, unable to save. Okay, when we have configured in the system. Okay, now you can understand here the configuration for this risk category. Okay, it's a high risk category customer. Okay, risk category. You just forget about the configuration. What we have done, the configuration we have done. System need to perform the credit management and system should should not allow. OK, here you can see the D D in the sense it's a like error message. System should throw the warn error message. OK, now and also immediately the system should block because this doesn't require because if it is a warning message in the sense initial stage itself, a system is stopping to the users. Now you can see here credit check SAP credit management failed unable to save, but as compared with the warning message what system is giving here credit check SAP credit management failed so meaning that even though if this credit check has been failed even though if you if you want to allow then system will allow to users to create the sales order to place the sales order and it will immediately it will get block the sales order okay now the difference between this is the warning message where you can see here unable to save in the sense completely you cannot able to move forward until to okay until to refill that credit limit or uh, until to clear the open items okay then only the system will allow to particular customers this is what what we have expected okay now you can see here this is the warning message warning message stating that okay let me try to enter this one okay let me try to error message anyhow we cannot move forward here system is stopping here itself okay now let me try to enter okay even though even though system is allowing okay let me try to save this one okay now first warning message let me try to save this one whether system will allow me to or not okay again system is now as i told why it is getting twice okay why system is getting that two two times okay so because because in the credit management in the credit management check for this one for a medium risk customer what i have activated item check so because of this activation what system is throwing that message okay so system while creation while placing that order after entering that amount then system was showing then again while creation of the while saving the sales order also system is showing this message because due to the fact okay so we have selected item wise also we want to perform the credit check okay now let me enter this one document incompletion okay okay because of some grass weight i know this one okay because of grass okay net weight only this i know it's a non issue then let me come back edit check in completion log no error no in completion log let me save this one again it is just giving the warning message only but we want to now you can see here the order has been created two three double eight the order has been created the condition what we have maintained here now for this one medium risk category system should throw the warning message and it should get block immediately the sales order should be blocked okay so the authorized person will go back and will will release that order in vkm4 okay the trans the, that is the particular transaction code they will go back and they will release that order but now let us try this one what system will say okay in case if it is a error message okay now let me try to continue let me try to continue what will say system see now system completely it is stopping okay credit check sap credit management failed credit okay segment trm okay for this business partner so meaning that here what we have done for this for this business partner okay for this risk category now you can see here okay we wish the system should not allow us to move forward the system should not allow us to move forward here itself the system should stop okay i do not want to even should allow to create the sales order okay this is what the reactions what we have done okay now this is the way okay but only the configuration is the important here if we miss some 
shipping here then if there will not have any proper configuration here system will not work properly okay this is the key area whatever the configuration we have done okay that is the one thing then the then the we need to understand the how system is going to perform okay if something you something is goes wrong okay something is not performing credit check okay only the four places are there okay to check the okay if system is not performing the credit check then there are four places as i told okay the four places in the sense assign okay there are two things which we need to perform here assign sales sales documents and delivery level here in the this step what we need to do the the sales order level which sales order you are using okay the document the is a standard order is a or okay for this order we want to perform the credit check and credit group what is the credit group this is the sales order level okay we are giving instruction to the system perform the credit check when we are placing the sales order by using this sales order type remember point number one then point number two is that credit check for the delivery types okay now if you are using what is the standard deliveries okay now come back and specify here also uh, okay check with your sd consultant what is the delivery okay delivery type for that delivery type you can map the credit check there will be a one more check the pricing procedure level okay Pr pricing procedure level also we can map okay you the standard pricing procedure level also we can we can specify the credit check but that is the optional but now these two we must have to specify okay three then the next one is that the auto define auto credit control so these are the four checks are mandatory okay i mean only the third one is not mandatory the pricing procedure level if you map and you do not map also system will work okay now these are the important things here where we can see here okay if we are not going to properly mapping here then as i shown here the sales order whatever the sales order this was the sales order created two three double eight then you just come back here vkm4 vkm4 <coughs> then give the credit control area just execute it so that you can able to see here now you can see what is the sales order 2388 it has been created now just select this one select this one then <coughs> save it see now sales document is approval okay now now again again this document this document it is it is uh, now it is an approval state into the sales order okay now whoever is authorized person 